You will need to normalize in your mind walking alone. You got to get up on your own. You got to be able to make big decisions on your own. You got to lose weight on your own. There are a myriad of targets you have to hit by yourself. Oftentimes, it's the people that go away into a very healthy isolation to equip themselves, to condition themselves, to educate themselves, to come out empowered. And so you got to get into this workspace where you can do it by yourself. It doesn't matter if it's the office. It doesn't matter if it's the gym. It doesn't matter if it's the court. It doesn't matter if it's the field. It doesn't matter what arena you are stepping into. You got to get to that place where you don't need attention. You don't need recognition. You don't need the accolades. You just want to put in the work. And the next time you surface, the next time you show up, it's game over. If you throw me to the wolves, I'll return, leading the pack. You see, a wolf is willing to leave its pack behind and find a new one. The time is now. We must adopt the wolf mentality. Be relentless. Resilient. Never quit. And never look back. I know what it feels like to be fractured and falling into pieces. But you got to silence the voices in your head that are telling you, you need a shortcut, you need a cheat code. Eliminate the negative, self-sabotaging voices. Find a mirror and tell yourself, I got this today. <laughs> I got this today. I'm going to make it. I'm going to create it. I'm going to build it. All I have is all I need. Resources may come and go. People may come and go. But I've got a vision and I've got the provision. And I've got the determination and the discipline to hit my aims and to punch through my targets. Can you do this thing without attention? Can you do this thing without public affirmation? Can you do this thing without people telling you that you are everything today? Without people applauding you and saying you're great, you're awesome, oh, you're amazing. Can you do this thing alone? Can you be your own cheerleader for a moment? Can you be your own hype man for a moment? Can you tell you I'm good enough? I got this, that all I have is all I need. I believe in friendships and partnerships and collaboration and counsel and advice, but there are some things in life you are going to have to do alone. There are some arenas you're gonna to have to show up in and nobody is coming. Nobody's coming to save you, nobody's coming to help you, nobody's coming to show you a shortcut. You gotta figure this out on your own. For most of us, nobody's gonna feed us. You gotta feed yourself. You wanna lose the weight? You wanna reach your target, your aim? You gotta put the work in. You gotta feed yourself the food that is required to power the body that you want. It's not about trying to be a Lone Ranger more than it is about taking responsibility and prioritizing yourself first. There are some things in life nobody's gonna show up. It's all on you. I need you to find a mirror right now and tell yourself, it's all on me, it's all on me. This one is all on me. When I go get this degree, ultimately, I gotta go get this degree. When I go get this certification, ultimately, I got to get this certification. I've got to finish strong. I've got to condition myself. I've got to go get the education. I've got to get out of bed. I've got to go to the gym. I've got to eat clean. Nobody's going to feed me. i got to feed myself. If you're listening to me right now in the gym, on your walk, on your run, you're lifting, you're building, you're creating, you're imagining something, I just need you to push. And I need you to believe that you don't need the spider, that you don't need the training wheels, that it is your time, that it is your turn, and you no longer need help, you no longer need assistance in this area of your life. Push like you have never pushed before. Give it everything you have, because that spider is not going to be there for you for the rest of your life.
If you want to grow one millimeter more, if you want to push, just push a little harder. Everybody wants to grow a little bit taller, so we got to push a little bit harder. Life is lived on levels, and I can't bring my spotter with me. The spotter cannot walk with you all of your life. At some point, you got to say, I got this. I got this. Push! Look yourself in the mirror and tell yourself, I got this. Got this. If I have to do it alone, I will. Because to fulfill this vision, to fulfill my destiny, ultimately, I'm depending on the God that put the dream in my heart and myself. With tears in your eyes, with broken hands and a heavy heart, if nobody is there, then you are in a room by yourself. Start alone, but get started. Help is coming, but everything rises and falls on you. Oftentimes, the people that you wanted in your life will reject you, and that rejection is protection. It is a blessing because it's the same people that rejected you that will need you and that will rely on you. Come on, how many people have you tried to help when you were bleeding, battered, and broken? How many times have you called for help and the help was toxic? Come on, how many times have you asked for advice and the advice brought more adversity. Take responsibility for yourself. Take control of your life. I need you to understand your worth and stop playing the blame game because nine times out of 10, the people that hurt you, you brought them into your life. And so you got to reflect over the past. You have to acknowledge the present and you have to cast vision for your future and take accountability and kill the self-condemnation. Stop tearing yourself down on the inside. Stop saying one thing, thinking another, and acting in a whole nother way. How you think is how you talk, and how you talk must be how you behave. Because your thoughts will determine your behavior, and your behavior determines your future. And so everything's got to line up. And so you need an alignment, an internal alignment. I can't align you. you got to make the decision to align yourself. You can hear a speech and make a decision, but every day you have to make that decision. That decision has to evolve into discipline. And discipline turns into mastery. And mastery builds momentum. You're not going to always get it right, but you better keep going. When you start alone, you possess a power that few can handle.